You are now watching episode four of Indie Vibes and Red Fat Tuesdays. Getting ready to head to Fam Fest. I bet you want to know who she is. Stay tuned. Hey yo. Chelsea Blue is here, and I bet you guys have been dying since the intro to find out who this beautiful chick is I have on the side of me. Give it up for Nana Love. Hi. How are you doing? I'm wonderful. Excited to be on the show? I am. I'm actually a huge fan of the show. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Uh, Nana's actually going to be our amazing guest host that actually comes on a lot more in the series. So take a good look. We're going to get to see a lot more. <laughs> you will. <laughs> So come on, Nana, tell us a bit more. What do indie vibers need to know about Nana Love? Well, um, just a normal girl living a normal life. No. <laughs> <laughs> That's never true. No. <laughs> I usually travel a lot for work. Um, I'm trying to wean off of it, but I, I travel a lot on the seas for work a lot. Nice one. Yeah. Um, so I get to see a lot of the family islands, a lot of the keys that a lot of people don't, don't really get to see. see. Oh, nice yeah. one. And as you can see, we are here at the one and only Fat Tuesday. Yes. Actually, it's Nana's first time. It so. is. <laughs> are you enjoying it? I am, and I I always um, go for a strawberry diaper. Is it? Strawberry mango diaper, just to compare to other places. <laughs> so Nana's got me hooked on strawberry mango, and obviously because we're going to a wonderful gospel event, mm -hmm. we're going to keep it quite clean and uh, have a few virgin diapers. <laughs> For now, <laughs> you can see, like, they've totally dressed our table out. I'm so excited about it. Right? What do you think right. of the service so far? The service is awesome. The guys are great. Flex is awesome. Where is he? He's somewhere around here, but he's awesome. <laughs> Shout out to Flex. <laughs> you better be watching this episode too. Oh, the food here is great. It's so oh, I'm so happy I get to be the one that like gets you into like Fat Tuesdays. I know. Because when it first came out, I was like, I gotta go, I gotta go, and I tried the food, and it was absolutely amazing. So like, this is gonna be my first time at Fat Fest. Awesome. I know, I'm super excited because I'm actually gonna be performing on the Saturday night. Oh really? <laughs> yes. Wow. Well. Hey. Yes. yes. Everything's great. Absolutely perfect. I'm in love with the daiquiris. I cannot wait to order some food. She's never had the pizza. It's her first okay. time. Lovers. Yeah. Oh, oh me lovers. <gasps> I love me. <laughs> I love I'm just me. letting you know. If you feed me, you have to marry me. What? Just saying. Plots. <laughs> 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 I'm joking. I'm, 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 no problem. Thank you. Thank you. So what is this about feeding you to marry you? Um. Well, what I can't wait was. to go to farm first. <laughs> Because as far as I've heard, they do sell food out there. Yes, they do. So, uh... I haven't been in the last two years, though, so I'm really excited about this year. Is it? I, yeah. So it's almost going to be like a first time for the both of us. For this one, definitely, yeah. I'm excited. Yes, I'm very excited. As we get prepared and uh, finish off these wonderful daiquiris and order meat lovers pizza from Factory Stars. Lovely daiquiris. We are going to have our next music video by... Daddy White, and it's called Chocolates. Hey ladies, I won't feel no one right, you want dry marsh, no go on right, but if this song pertains to you or one of your friends, well, guess what? You are a jungle. She jungle. She jungle. Got a Haitian junglers, look like Jamaican Sister junglers, innocence asking Junglers friends, love the bar clothes Junglers talks, gossip or broke Junglers dance, junglers Facebook Junglers friends, from my yearbook Junglers ask who buying lunch Junglers say they boyfriend punk Junglers need to go to church I never seen a junglers work. I don't mess with junglers They hang out with them smugglers She junglers She junglers She junglers she jumped us. I got it. She jumped us. 
Yeah. Jungler's bread like tuna sandwich. Take them out, they ain't got no mind. Take them home, they wanna meet your parents. Tell their friends where to keep the cameras. Take them on a date, can't read the menu. Dump the dum 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 jungler simple. Love the fight, they baby daddy. Ask him, he in court like every Friday. Everywhere, ride the bus. Lady cop said to stop. Change your wheel, clean your feet. Out of Paco, brush your teeth. Hey everybody, it's Boitino. We are here at the Farm Fest with the wonderful, the new. Wonderful. Let's just have a moment of silence for now. Really? Not allowed. How you doing? <laughs> and our wonderful guest. Stacks and Sai. What up, though? What up, not Stacks and C. Not Stacks and not C. Because everybody right. said, I said C at the beginning, <laughs> but don't put no C in. Guys, let me touch you. How y'all feel it? I'm sorry, how y'all feel it? How y'all feel it? Good? Love okay. art. So, do you art? Yes, we are very artsy. We do music, write music, poetry, nice. skits, nice. music, more music. Yeah, we art. I think we art. We art. Yeah, we art. We are. Art. Right. Art. 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 Nice. You got any like new projects coming out anytime soon? Uh, yeah, for sure. We are planning on working on an EP. Not sure as yet, but we're planning on working on an EP. And maybe a song will drop, you know, in January. You know, that. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. Can we get the name though? Do you gotta tell them? Only be only ask them. Just know it's about some girls. Yeah. Oh! 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 oh, you heard it it's first. It's about some girls. Some okay, girls. here we go. Here we go. Some we know where this All is right. going. We know where this is going. Uh, it's about some girls. Yeah. <laughs> so we guys, we heard you guys just got off uh, tour. What did you guys go through? Um, well, we just went through the tour. Um, we went on a tour called the Extreme Tour. It's it's a company or organization. Organization has been around for like 21 years, and we are part of the East Coast, Philadelphia, West Virginia, oh, North wow. Carolina, um, Bronx, New York, Long Island, New York, Long Beach, New York, Atlanta, Moultrie, Georgia, the Bahamas. I can't even I can't even remember where we've been. We've been yes, all like our different cities. Right. Oh, 52 cities in wow. four months. Yeah. yeah. Wow. So what was like your favorite place to go to perform? What was like the, the hypest crowd? What was the liveest place you all go? Yeah, that would be St. Cloud. Oh yeah, oh, they turned really? all yeah. We performed in this place called The Warehouse. Right. Lit. Yeah. Start to finish. So St. Cloud, The Warehouse, definitely Florida. Awesome. Shout out St. Cloud, Florida. King Cloud, Florida. St. Cloud, Florida. St. Cloud, Florida. 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 Um, wow. so what message is it that you guys are trying to portray, put out there as gospel artists? Um, I would say for us, we want to spread like a, a positive message in our music. I think when people have gospel rapper or gospel artists, they tend to think, okay, these guys are religious idiots that just want to push like a message that I don't even understand right. in their face. But we're like rappers that are Christians. We don't just make music for the walls of the church. We make music that people can relate to. So whether you on the block, you want to make music that you can relate to. Who's in the jail can relate to. Kind of like relatable music. So our message is just, there's more to life than what you see. If you believe in a higher power or not, but there is more to life than what you see. Like you can see with the human eye. That's, that's I'm looking at the human eye. So it's basically, it's basically hope in a message. Hope in, hope in the music. Awesome. And to oh, add on awesome. to that, we just want, when you listen to the music, we want you to think. Like, we don't want you to, to be, like, say, okay, these guys just do gospel music. We want you to think, you know, it's beyond your imagination. Right, right. right. So what is, like, your process to, like, what inspires you to even make this music, make this type of music? I would say when we, when we get together in the studio, problems. Like, we just, we just did this new song. Right in our minds that is. We, we, we haven't recorded it yet, but we're together, heard a beat, someone got excited, the next person got excited, we had a song. Wow, wow. Awesome. <laughs> wow. That's how magic happens, guys. That's, it, that's, magic. that's how magic happens. Hands the beat, get a topic, <laughs> sing harmonies and really bad notes, we got to hit it. Bad notes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> all that happens all the time. There's nothing about it. I want to hear that. I really want to hear it. <laughs> no, I love it. Wow. So, um, you guys have been together for how long now? Five years. Five whole years. Five whole wow. Years. I can remember. <laughs> I can remember one particular year that you don't remember, but um, it's a very vintage CD. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah. Wow. wow. Yeah. It's vintage. Boy, Luther King had that CD. <laughs> you guys. Why did you have inspiration? I, I, 
Volume one. There were two volumes. Okay. <laughs> I have it because they threw it out. Oh, the you didn't know this didn't have his hair. Yeah, I didn't have his hair. He didn't have his hair. I've been waiting for the longest touch of hair. But yeah, it's still in the plastic and everything. So when you guys really, really make it big, like really, really big, this is going to be worth something. Oh, I don't know. I just might rob you. I just might rob you. No, but it's good to see that you guys are still going for such a long time and didn't give up. And it's actually very inspiring from throwing out free CDs in a crowd to going on a whole East Coast tour. So you guys are... So like how you guys even started? Like how you... Oh. Is this is it brother? Let's like yes. The long lost That's a long story. You guys can bring up the popcorn and the soda. <laughs> oh. I just started off by saying we went to high school for the three years. Yeah. We, failed the, we failed the same classes together. <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it was a map. George Johnson, Mr. Collins, I see y'all. <laughs> Mr. 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 Riley, Andy Vaughn. Vaughn. I love you, man. So I'm sweet. sorry for what I did in your classes. <laughs> I started off by saying we went to high school for three years, had the same glasses, and then you should know the rest of the story. I know the rest of the story, but I like what you tell it. Ah, uh, so he, he was in the same class, right, and he was like, dude, he was sitting on the side of me, he's like, dude, you watch wrestling last night? I was like, dude, I don't even know you. That was the conversation started? That was the Why first thing. Yeah, he was there. <laughs> <laughs> that was your pick up line. All my friends went to government high, I need a friend. I went to government high. I love that school. All um, my friends went to government. I was the only one from AF Party that went to Dora, so I was trying to find friends. I need uh, friends. Yeah. Wrestling. <laughs> Hello. Hey, who doesn't watch wrestling? Oh, was, oh, wrestling people. was popping back. Okay. Oh, yeah. So, first of all, we'd like to thank you guys for being on our show. We really appreciate it. Thank you for having us. Really appreciate it. But I know you are doing so, so, so much big things, right? But remember me, though. Wait, you know. Look here, the city. I tell him yes, the city. Yes, yes. But anyway, we have uh, <laughs> Next video by these guys, beautiful people. How does it go? Sing it. Let's go. One shot. Two shot. Ay 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 Five shots, six shots, seven shots and more Every day a body hit the floor, everybody yelling out war These people getting robbed and they losing their jobs and the hurtful part is there's more uh, Standing on the corner chasing that paper not knowing if you see whom they tough I'm getting worried, folks really sorry and they still shut the door It's like nobody cares anymore, run up in your face and abuse your grace What a disgrace when a human race don't wanna embrace, just wanna debate Shoot you in your face, put you in a case and attend your funeral and eat your cake When will we recognize, be equalized, be civilized and compromise Then maybe our real eyes could realize Realize, don't be analyzed. Yeah. All we really want is a better nation. Cause there's violence everywhere that we go. And what are we all fighting for? Or can we just let it all go? We're beautiful people. We're beautiful people. We're beautiful people. Yeah, we're beautiful. We're beautiful, beauty, but we're beautiful okay. people. All I'm seeing is AKs, dead bodies, crime scenes, crying mamas, angry daddies, jail full of them young teens. Headshot, phone call, bad news, mom screams, yellow tape, ambulance. Every day in the hood is a routine. Everything is going loco. A generation's in a chokehold, feeling like a Marion with that icebox. Just the way we living is so cold. When it comes to love, we make no efforts. We aborted all the methods. We claim the life we live is precious. But we squeeze that gun to someone's breathless, so reckless. Don't get me started on some rappers with they violent rhymes. All they do is add fire to these wicked times You rap about popping molly sex and shooting nines But when somebody dies, you hold a picket sign All we really want is a better nation Cause there's violence everywhere that we go And what are we all fighting for? Or can we just let it all go? We're beautiful people We're beautiful people We're beautiful people Hey everybody, this is Wayne Chino and the wonderful Nana Love. Nana Love. Nana Love. I like how you say that. Nana so much emphasis. How do you say love in Spanish? Amor or something? Amor. Nana Amor. Oh, <laughs> Chelsea Azul. <laughs> Nana Amor. There we go. There we go. We got it. Anyways, Fun Fest. I got a Spanish name. I feel so officially introduced. Fun Fest was amazing. Did you, did you enjoy Fun Fest? I did. It was awesome. It was awesome. Shout out to Chelsea Blues, he did a thing on stage, Chelsea you were awesome. Shout out to King Cloud. And King Cloud. <laughs> he was pretty good, he was pretty good. 
Did some He's like, he's like. Uh, what the why? <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, this has been episode four. Oh no, those for episode four. Be sure to check us out on episode five. Episode. Single for the Halloween special. And also, it's the season finale of Indie Vibes. Yes, yes, yes. So, we won't be seeing this until next season. So, it's been fun. It's been real. It's been real. Real. Okay, you can get us Indie Vibes at the follower at the end of the month on the 30th at the West Ridge Mansion. It's going to be great. Fun, wear your costumes, be all fresh up and thing and thing. Get us there, take some pictures with us, some selfies. Yeah. Yeah, so we hope to get see you guys there. Thank you again for watching. Yes, 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 yes. Now we're going to have a music video by He and Shaw's Fury. You can go. My boy. Yeah, boy. That's your chico. Sir. Hi. <laughs>